can missed beasts market cap at $188,000 compete against the likes of Andrew Tate's daddy meme coin at $81 million would beast be able to reach up to that $81 million and maybe flip daddy after 50% drop can pickle rise back up like a phoenix and break through its all-time highs and finally is this the best buying opportunity for success kid so stick around for the video so let's roll the intro <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to Total Crypto for another video. Guys, before we get into these memes, let's quickly check out what's happening with Ethereum and BTC because ultimately, because whenever we see a big move coming in, whether it's up or down for Ethereum or BTC effectively, because it can either put us in a major profit or decimate the entire project. So far it looks like with Ethereum, we're in fact stabilizing and slowly staircasing our way to the upside. We are still roughly around about between 10 or 11 percent away from this level right up here. Actually, because we've been climbing up already, we're now roughly around about 8 percent or 9 percent away from this level of cluster. Once we do break above this cluster right over here, then we should be able to retest back up to around about $3,361,000 to $3,467. But overall, we really need to pay close attention to BTC because potentially we could see either a move to the upside or to the downside. For me, this is the most important levels that we must break. Because if I zoom out a bit more on the chart, let's do a full screen. And what we can see, we've in fact went all the way back down to and we've actually wicked into the areas of 53, around about between 53 and yeah, $53,000. But then as we can see, we got brought up quickly and all this selling pressure, the German government selling off all of their BTC. They've still got quite a bit of BTC left that they're looking to sell. Every time they sold all of their BTC, BlackRock in fact bought them up. Hence why we're seeing these wicks to the bottom being brought right back up into these levels. If we take a closer look on what's going on here, if we don't stay above uh, the horizontal line right up here, and as we can see to our left, this is the most important area. If we don't stay up here and above, if we consolidate here long enough, I can only see us potentially heading, heading our way back down to the lower levels. And if we do see ourselves heading back down below these levels, then guys, it only makes sense for us to retest back down to the levels of $51,000 and $52,000. And then from there, we will slowly make our way back up again. Because the way this cluster looks like right now, this is a most critical level for the short term because Either way, it's looking like that we are likely to head right back down into this area there because of all of these, because of these candles of invalidation. Normally, whenever we see candles like this and we didn't see like a healthy move to the upside, we always immediately or at some point in the near future, we will see ourselves to retest back down to that initial breakup from this massive parabolic move. And that's why whenever we came down close to this level, that's obviously because of the big investors and the hedge funds, in this case, the German government, been dumping all of their BTCs and BlackRock has been buying them up. But who knows, everyone might decide to try to dump their BTCs a little bit more. So big institutions like the BlackRock, other official governments and hedge funds will buy BTC at a cheaper price of anywhere between $53,000 to $51,000. So how does this impact within the meme space? Well, let me show you. If BTC continues to go back down, then we can only see the likes of the likes of Daddy and also Mr. Beast meme coins will be going much more further down. However, Mr. Beast hasn't got that much of data, so we may need to go check out other meme coins that's been around for a little while. Let's head over to Success Kid instead. So for success kid has been extremely solid in during the volatility moves from BTC and the rest of the meme space, which gives me a strong belief that when I come down to success kid, that this is most definitely a robust community, 
strong meme coin that can weather the storm. And in fact, if we go into a high time frame, if you look at this from the overall picture, guys, this is extremely bullish because one, since we made this nice run to the upside, we then fell back immediately. But if we compare it to BTC, whilst you know, we've been kind of hopping around here and made a slight little bump to the upside, which in fact we desperately need to get back up to around about $63,000. And that will ultimately push the rest of the odds as well as the meme coins to go into a much more bigger prices. So we just need to see BTC to continue to push its way back up. So we can see the rest of the meme space, including Success Kid, to move up with it. Because Success Kid actually follows quite nicely with BTC whenever we do pump to the upside. So there's a lot of the space. But Success Kid, we don't dump as hard as most of other memes, which I reckon we can quite easily see a 30 million market cap within this year. I reckon in during the bull season that we should be able to see Success Kid to go even much more bigger prices. In fact, if you take a look at their circulating supply at of 88 million, plus the market cap is quite tiny. It's actually really tiny. And I reckon we can quite easily head away back up to the top and go to a much more bigger prices. Success Kid is still what I believe to be one of the most robust well-known, well-recognized meme out there that's been circulating online for many years, which gives me a strong confidence that they have a very strong community and ourselves coming back up to these levels right up here, then we can quite easily retest back its all-time highs. Now let me show you on a wider screen like how this looks. Once we do break above this level right over here, then we should continue way back up to roughly around about 13 cents and beyond. The highest that we have ever been was roughly around about 26 cents. I do believe that we can quite easily get to more than $1 per success kit. And that is just one of my predictions. And that is just one of my predictions. And as I'm super bullish on success kit, I've been holding this project for a little while now. And I'll continue to hold and add some more once we do see us break certain levels. So why don't we head over to Pickle? Pickle has seen a pretty decent dump. Either way, guys, I do believe that this is a nice buy opportunity. Why don't we change the chart into the full hourly, just so it looks more cleaner. Here we are, because whenever you're in doubt, always zoom out is what I always love to say. But anyway, let's mark out a few important areas that we need to clear in order for us to remain bullish. Either way, guys, anywhere within here for me is certainly a buying opportunity. So do not fear whenever we see a move like this. Because at the end of the day, whenever I see a massive fall down like that, I always tend to lock up them up and buy some more. At around about key levels, and this is most certainly a key level for me. If anything, it's like a reset. Because when I first started doing the video on Pickle, we were around about here. And I did say in my previous video that once we do see a breakup from above this resistance line, then that should be a good case of an entry. And if we do retest back in this level, add some more of your back, because ultimately we did this. Now that's a lovely, beautiful move to the upside. To put out the measuring tool so we can measure from that line all the way to the top, then you would have been earning yourself a nice, handsome 271% move to the upside. However, seeing as nothing goes up forever, whenever we see a big rise to the top, always make sure to take some profit, but maybe leave your initial trade within felt back right into this level. And that for me is a perfect accumulation zone, which means you can add some more of your bag for a potential quite soon maybe a retest back up to this level and to a much more higher prices remember it's always quite helpful to recycle your new profits because whenever we see a run up like this and let's say you put 100 dollars if you entered the 100 dollars and you made 271 dollars you could take your 271 dollars out you can leave your original 100 dollars from here and let it ride if it doesn't get much more higher and we do see us capitulating back down into that buying zone, then you can use some of your profits to re-enter around about there. 
because eventually once we do come back up to this highest and much more higher price then you will be in a massive profits this is not financial advice just showing exactly what i'm doing as this video is for educational purposes if you like to learn how to trade then head over towards my youtube channel subscribe hit the bell notification find the membership tab and subscribe to my daily membership because if you sign up with me on my membership youtube program you will find more of a educational content on how you can trade something like this and learn how to map up when to enter and when to exit how to take some of your profits and when to reaccumulate more of your tokens but anyway let's continue on with the video so if i would cover success kit pickle so let's swiftly move over to daddy this meme has done tremendously well and we can see much bigger prices coming in for daddy tate token so let's quickly dive into it right right now we're just ranging in the sideways action right over here this is my lovely accumulation phase right here so let's change some of these colors actually that will be the green this will be the green as well because that is my reaccumulation area right down here whereas up here is going to be the last all time highs right if we do see ourselves capitulating a bit more again i will still continue to buy up more because this is like the golden lock area and once we break above this level then we should be able to see at least a retest back into this highs right up here but just remember guys everything is always in phases but what i do like about this chart is firstly you see a bottom here then you see a lower low lower high and then a high high and secondly it doesn't have some crazy volatility just like the rest of the meme is really stable at the market cap of around about 18 million dollars and the moment we do break above from here and we see btc climbing to a much more bigger prices then i reckon we should be able to hit roughly around about 21 cents uh, in no time and then once we break through and above this cluster right up here and then we should head away back up to roughly around about 32 cents Now let's pull out the measuring tool. Let's say if we were enter here and we do hold until we get back up to the last all time highs, then you should be expecting roughly around about 131% move to the upside. But Mr. Beast himself, guys, this meme could in fact do something quite similar to Daddy Tate. If you take a look at the market cap, it's actually risen up quite crazily, but obviously, because of Tate himself. The question is, would Mr. Beast be as big as Mr. Andrew Tate himself, or would we be able to reach up to that $80 million market cap? And what does that mean for you if you were to invest as little as $100 in order for us to get to that $80 million market cap? You will see in the next clip just how much in profit that you will be. Right then, so far the market cap is currently at $151,000 and it looks like we could be dropping maybe just a little bit, but end of the day guys, I'm only using money which I can afford to lose because we never know, it might actually crash or it might go skyrocket. So anyway, that's enough about trading psychology, if you'd like to learn more of that, once again head over towards my YouTube channel, go into my membership section, subscribe and I will show you in a video on how to trade and get over your trading fees. All right, so the current market cap is at $168,000. Well, this is what I mean about meme space, guys. If the market cap is super low, we do tend to see like extreme volatility and we can see the price of the market cap really does bounce like up and down. All right, so you're here for the final prediction or one of my <laughs> predictions. Firstly, if we take a look at the market cap, we're currently at $166,000. Let's use that. 10x from here, the market cap would need to get to $1.6 million. 100x from here, we would need to see the market cap get to $16 million. And then 1,000x from here, the market cap would need to reach to $168 million.
dollars and that's a thousand x from here however judging by the daddy's market cap at 79 million dollars if we were to halve that a thousand x at the potential future market cap of 168 million dollars at the thousand x for mr beast and if we just halve that potential future market cap into and that'd be approximately 83.5 million dollar market cap which means potentially you could see a 500x from here and potentially if we were to halve that future market cap of 166 or 67 million dollars which would be at a thousand x if we halve that to 500x that means we would reach roughly similar to the same market cap as Andrew Tate. So that means in order for us to get to that same level of market cap, we should be expecting around about 500x from here. So all you then got to do, if you if you like to invest for the long term on Mr. Beast, or, or at least until the heights of this bull season, if you were to invest only with $100, and we hope that we do reach to a similar market cap as Andrew Tate, then your $100 times it by 500, that will turn to $50,000. And that is just with your initial $100 worth of investment right about here. And if we do reach up to that 79 or $80 million market cap, then you should be expecting roughly around about $50,000. And that guys, and that would be an insane returns just by investing $100. So guys, I'm going to leave it there. I hope you do find this video useful and informative. If you haven't done so already, then do me a favor. Head over towards my YouTube channel, subscribe right up here, hit the bell notification, scroll down, check out my last few videos, and I will see you all in the next one.